people, this is Fluffy Bunny, Viva La Android, and today I have the top 10 best apps for you guys. I haven't released a video for you guys in a couple weeks because I've been busy switching around my setup and I have college finals. It's the end of the semester, this is the last week so everything's kind of tight. So I will be providing you more videos after this week. I have more reviews coming of products for companies like a Phone Joy, a tablet, a lot more stuff and I will be giving away most of them away to you guys because I don't have anything to do with them. So you got giveaways coming up and then more apps so let's go ahead and start off with the first app and I'm actually gonna go ahead and put a wallpaper for this to work okay so I just put a wallpaper and now I can go to this app so you can choose a picture either from your gallery or the current wallpaper I'm gonna go ahead and choose the current wallpaper so you take it and you can choose how much blur you want and how much you want to dim it so I won't dim it I'll just dim it a little bit and give it a little bit of blur like this much so basically this is to make your icons and everything else pop out if you have a nice icon pack or something just make it pop out and it looks really good with the blur if you see that the next app we have is called lyrics grabber you can go ahead from here and choose any song you want and it'll give you the lyrics for it this is one way to do it or you can go home anything that i'm listening to so i'll go into imagine dragons all over the volume because of copyright i'll take a song like this and as soon as it starts playing you'll see a notification come up right there all the way to the left and if you grab it you'll see that it says lyrics imagine dragons it's time so automatically gets the lyrics for it i can click it and it'll give me all the lyrics for it. Share it, put it on Facebook, share it to the message, anything I want, or I can search a song that I want. It's really cool, you know, it's really fast. It's all pause the song right here and it disappears right away. And as soon as I click another song, it'll start, you know, already has the lyrics right there for you. So do check it out for yourself. The next app is called Remote Desktop. So I'll show you another clip right now that shows you how to work this. Okay, so this is the app Remote Desktop and this is by Google. All you gotta do is go to your computer and you gotta have Google Chrome installed on your computer. And then from there, go to the Google Chrome store on your computer and download the Chrome Remote Desktop add-on. Basically, you add it onto your Chrome Desktop and you can control your entire computer from this. But for some reason, it's not working for me right now. It says I'm having network issues. So if I click it and when I do enter my pin, and I'll click done. It's gonna say connecting but it's not gonna connect for some reason i'm having network issues but if you do it it should work for you guys it's really cool you can zoom in and out on the desktop you can click wherever you want use this keyboard to type on your computer so control your computer from your mouse and everything and then you can use this as a keyboard or a mouse while sitting back so yeah make sure you check it out for yourself i don't know why it's not working for me but it should work for you guys so the next app we have is called google camera this is a cool camera that Google really has a, a nice set of features for you to use. So if I drag this out like this, you see that it brings it out. You got the camera, a regular camera, and then you got lens blur, which you can focus on an object. You take a picture of it and then it tells you to slide the phone up. And when you do slide it up, so it'll make the background really unfocused. And then you got panorama effect, which you can go around and take a picture that's really really long and then you got the photosphere photosphere which is you take a 360 degree picture up down right left and you can look at it while tilting your device this is actually really really accurate i was so surprised of how accurate it is like when you do do it so when you do do it it'll like blend the picture so good together it makes it look like one picture and then you got your regular video camera now the one thing that i don't like about this camera is that it's not a 16 by 9 picture so I tried going into the settings there's nothing there to actually make it into 16 by 9 so once you do take the picture it's only this big it won't take advantage of your entire screen that's the only thing I don't like about it so make sure you check it out for yourself the next app we have is called weather love this is an application just for weather but the cool thing about this is that you can set the notification and now you have the degrees right there and your notification and when you do drag it down It'll tell you today and the next two days the weather for it so I can just hide them like this so if you just want it smaller you can just keep it like that or just open it going back to the main page of this itself it looks good you see the temperature right now the wind what time the Sun comes up and what time it goes down right there I can go to the left and it tells me the weather for like the next week and a half and then all the way to the right it tells you it by time entire day so by hours the next app we have is called Jack's Music Widget and once you take this it's just gonna 
tell you to open access settings so you can take this and enable the notification settings for this widget and you can customize the widget from here you can go back and I'll take out the widget right here to show you how it looks like so I have the widget right there I'm gonna play a song with some album art and you see right there it starts showing the album art through the whole thing and then on top it says the song name so I can resize it and make it as big as I want so you, should, you see the more I resize it the more I can see of the album art so I can make it this big and just put it on a separate page or I can make it small and put it with some other widgets and you also have some other ones you can choose from you can choose one where the album art is in the left side and then on the right side you got the name and everything like that so do check it out it's a really nice looking widget the next app we have is called black moonshine icon now this is an icon set and if you see it looks really really good this is my favorite icon set it is 99 cents the developer of this icon set is really up to date with this so the last update he had was a couple days ago and with the update he brought over 450 new icons to it so i'm pretty sure it's around 2500 icons now with this icon set and you see it makes everything looks good the gmail and everything is like more black it works with a lot of applications now even some that are not in the play store like showbox it has the icon for that clean master this is not the icon for it. i just i have no volunteer so i'm able to do this and then go into edit now i can edit each icon to whatever i want but you see snapchat everything it's really detailed if you look at it they're really high resolution icons and it does come with a wallpaper set so make sure to check it out for yourself. The next app we have is called FTTT. Now what this stands for is F then, then now. Or something like that, I'm not sure. But anyways, this is a cool app. It's kind of like Tasker without root. You can tell it to do a bunch of things. So I have three set up. The first one is a daily email that I get whenever new recipes come out for this app. A recipe is whatever you enable it to do. And you like for this one I have if on Instagram, if a new photo is uploaded within the area I selected around me, then send me a notification. So if anyone around my area uploads a picture, if I'm not following them, I get a notification and I can see the picture. And then I have another one is if the San Antonio Spurs start the game, then I get a notification. You can go through and go th take the glasses and look through a whole bunch of ones that people make and are trending and are on the top so these are recipes for a road trip you take it and see all the ones that are you know for a road trip so log all of my trips to a google spreadsheet all the trips that you take and tracks automatically they will be uploaded to your google drive on a google spreadsheet so email me when friends add a, add the hashtag road trip so you can make it whenever anyone uploads a picture hashtag this app is really deep with what you can do with it it's only been out for about a month and like that and there's already a bunch so these are the top right here back up my contacts to google spreadsheet so whenever you upload put a new contact it'll automatically be uploaded to your google spreadsheet you can look at it through your computer or whatever you want. So make sure you check it out for yourself. I really, really like this app. I just started using it and I only have a couple recipes, but it is really useful. Then the last app we have is called Timer. It's perfect for if you work out, because I have been looking for a timer that works workouts, but I haven't really found any. Make it into a multiple times and then you can make it for how many sets you want. So I have 10 seconds of preparation that's the first one so you get 10 seconds you click it and then you get 10 seconds to prepare for the workout and then you get 30 seconds for the workout and then 10 seconds to rest and then it repeats to 30 seconds and 10 five times so if i click uh start timer started it starts the 10 seconds of preparation so right now you'd be preparing for it so this is actually for ab workouts i made it for ab workouts so right now it started the workout we got 30 seconds and once the 30 seconds are done it's going to go into 10 seconds of rest so you get 10 seconds to rest and then you get a 30 seconds start again the preparation doesn't start it's only the beginning the 30 seconds start and then 10 seconds to rest that's going to do it five times for five workouts so so do check it out for yourself the best workout app i've seen right here so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you drop a like down below if you did enjoy it because i do have more videos coming out for you guys and more giveaways i really i do have a lot of stuff to give away for you guys it's like more than 10 stuff controllers giving away two tablets and all that good stuff so make sure to subscribe for that and like always android for life
Peace. Dreaming big, town is small, and it's going down. All I need is a microphone, I'm headed for the crown, y'all. Call me whack, call me weak, say I'll never blow. Memphis bleak, they know like the radio that Henderson was meant to speak. I'm on these tracks, just like Tom.